2. The SEC will take over Atlanta and All-SEC Championship game, Alabama against LSU in 2011, ushered in the end of the Bowl Championship Series. It's only fitting that the first same conference championship of the playoff era will again pit two teams from the league. As kickoff began here at the Superdome, Georgia was sealing a classic Rose Bowl win against Oklahoma, setting up a date with Alabama in the Bulldogs' backyard. Unlike as in 2011, when now less you topped Alabama during the regular season, there will be no earlier point of comparison when the Tide and Bulldogs match up next Monday. But there will be no surprises, Alabama knows what Georgia is about and vice versa, with Saban's former chief lieutenant, Kirby Smart, already installing his own version of the process to bring Georgia within a win of its first national title in decades. 1. Angry Alabama as a program Alabama may have heard that Clemson was prepared to rip away its crown as the dominant team in college football. By controlling the line of scrimmage on both sides of the ball, dictating field position and dominating the time of possession, the Crimson Tide reasserted themselves in the third meeting with Clemson in as many years. And they did so by returning to basics, with a playing style that resembled the Alabama teams of the recent past, the early title teams of the Nick Saban era Clemson, which accounted for more than 1,000 yards of offense in the past two meetings combined, was held to just 188 yards. The Tigers' vaunted defensive line was held in check by Alabama's offensive front, if not outright dominated. Alabama's own defensive line was physical and punishing, with an added dash of flair. De'Aaron Payne not only made an interception but concluded the ensuing drive with a short touchdown grab to push the Tide's lead to 17-6 in the third quarter. A pick-six by linebacker Mac Wilson on Clemson's next offensive play made it 24-6 and sealed the Tide's return trip to the title game. It was a dominant performance by a team many believed had backed its way into the playoff field after ending the regular season with an Iron Bowl loss to Auburn. But Alabama is like the Incredible Hulk, you won't like the Tide when they're angry. Alabama suffocates Clemson in dominant Sugar Bowl victory to set up Paul SEC title game. Sports Paul Meyerberg and Nancy Armour break down Alabama's victory over Clemson in the Sugar Bowl, the third consecutive college football playoff matchup between the two programs. New Orleans, Alabama dominated Clemson 24-6 in the Sugar Bowl to take the rubber match between the two programs and book its trip to next week's college football playoff national championship game. There the Crimson Tide will meet Georgia in an all-Southeastern Conference finale. Here are three takeaways from Alabama's win. 